I actually got this package two weeks ago and I've been dying to open it. What's up YouTube? Welcome back to the Project Land Life with me, Maro. In today's video, we will be doing an unpacking. In today's video, we will be unpacking this new package that just came in. Well, came in about two weeks ago. Before anything else, please do give this video a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, please do subscribe. I really do appreciate it and I try to post content every week. First and foremost, I would like to thank a fellow YouTuber that actually helped me get this package. As you all should know, I actually ordered this during Black Friday when they had a big sale. And it's all thanks to Mr. Paul Fentabella and his YouTube channel, The Locust and Wild Honey. So thank you Mr. Paul Fentabella and back of me and all the other people who have actually got their orders from the Black Friday sale. Thank you for giving us this big discount. And this is actually my first time to get any minimal piece, so I'm very excited to unpack it for you guys. But with that being said, let's go straight into the unpacking. So here we go. So guys, here they are, the two items I bought off Minimal. So basically the reason why I decided to buy something off Minimal besides the discount was, well, I wanted to venture out and try some new brands. So first, let's look at the first piece, which is the M128 denim in black. So it comes in this, so it came in this nice plastic package with Minimal written in the middle of it. So again, this is the M128 denim in the black colorway, and I got it in a size 33. Usually, I'm a size 32 to 34, depending on the fit. So here they guys are, the minimal M128 denim in black. And right off the bat, I do like the color of it. As you can see, the color is in black, but the wash makes it uh, fade a little bit, more of a distressed color, which is a look I really like. The only thing that I did not know before and before buying it was I actually thought that uh, there there'd be a zipper uh, on the crotch area rather than the, the, this button which I'm not really a big fan of but it's, no, it's not really that much of a deal breaker for me it's just basically my preference. Moving into the back we've got the nice minimal branding right here in leather. There are actually two pockets in the front, left and right. Into the back, we got two more back pockets. And the thing that I really liked about this pair of jeans was at the bottom, they actually have this zipper that the ankle zips really help with uh, customizing how you want uh, your look to be. Okay guys, so after wearing the minimal M128 denim jeans, there's some things I want to say. First fit wise, I did get this in a size 33. Normally my size on jeans are from 32 to 34 depending on the cut of the jeans. And for these jeans in particular, I happen to know for a fact that this runs slim fit. So I did get a size 33 which is in the middle of what I usually get just because I didn't want it to fit too loose nor to fit too tight. and I had the presumption that since Minimal is a American brand, that their sizing would actually be bigger. But having to fit this, I'm actually glad that I didn't go down to a 32 because if because if it did, then I don't think this would have fit me. But the fit on these jeans for me is a bit different to what jeans I normally have. So starting off, I happen to notice that the fit on the thigh part for me is a bit tighter compared to the lower leg, which is a bit, which is normal for me, I guess, because uh, normally this is the problem I get with most slim fit and skinny jeans. So I'm, I'm accustomed to it. It's not really a problem for me. But going down on the jeans, it actually loosens up a little bit more until the ankle area. And as you can see on the ankle area, it offers a nice stack effect on your legs. So yeah, that basically covers my review of the M128 denim jeans for minimal. So next on the review is the draw cord shorts. This is by far the, the thing I've been eyeing to get to. So here you guys have it, the minimal cargo draw cord shorts. 
And right from my first impression, I really am liking this look. I mean, it's not like everywhere you can find cargo shorts that actually look really fire. And I know right from the bat, first thing you saw was this nice yellow draw cord which just pops. So first, right from the waist, you can see that it is elastic and it is made out of cut, um, some cotton material. Going down to the front side, you have this two big pockets uh, that are actually really, really big. I mean, look at that. But there are also another two pockets on the side, so left and right. And again, at the back, you have two more pockets. But just as you may think that you have already enough pockets, Minimal decided to put another set of pockets right here at the side, at the very bottom part of the shorts. Okay guys, so after wearing the minimal cargo jaw cord shorts, all I can say is that this is a really good piece. Some details I would like to comment on this pair of shorts is that first, the upper is made out of this nice cotton elastic material, which makes putting it on easier. And also you get this nice pop of color with the nice yellow elastic jaw cord. And what makes this shorts, other than stylish, more functional is that the way it has a lot of pockets. I mean, I counted it all down. There are eight pockets on this pair of shorts. I mean, you would not lack pockets with this. Not like, not like you need eight pockets to put your stuff in though, but I mean, the way they've designed the, where to put the pockets in, make it look so stylish, so fire. Just a little bit of detail that I would like to shed some light on, which I think is a nice touch for minimal is that if you can see the side pocket here at the lower part of the shorts, you can actually see that this pocket actually lengthens out more than the original shorts. So it's just a nice touch of detail that adds a nice contrast whenever you put it on. And lastly, talking about size-wise, I did get a size large in these, which in the website says runs from a men's waistline of 32 to 34. And it just fits me perfectly, just as I said. This is overall the best shorts I have gotten in a while. But that pretty much sums up my entire haul from my first ever encounter with Minimal during this Black Friday sale. And overall, with my first impression of Minimal, all I can say is that Minimal is a good brand, lots of good pieces, and I would really recommend you guys try it out for yourself. But that pretty much sums up the video. If you did enjoy this video, please do again give this video a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, please do subscribe. I really do appreciate it. Again, this has been Moral from the Project Lime Life. I'll see you all in the next vlog. See ya. Peace out. Thank you.